What the fuck is up, y'all? Mr. Mac and Hose back for another Tuesday here on Juggalo Day. <clears throat> so, first, uh, to catch up on last week's video, because uh, I done goofed and just kind of, you know, <clears throat> chucked it on the wayside, was worrying about some other shit. Um, dream cars. Uh, for me, personally, uh, I've always really wanted a Mitsubishi Lancer Evo 6. Like the old, the blocky ones, not the uh, more sleek looking, clean ones. Um, it'd kind of be like the, uh, what was it, the, uh, was it green or was it gold? I can't remember. Uh, in uh, Need for Speed Tokyo Drift. Uh He's one of the main guy's cars. Um, <clears throat> I've always been a huge fan of them. I don't know why, but just love the shit out of them. Um, anyways, with that said, we are in a, uh, what is it, a uh, extreme thunderstorm warning or something like that? I don't know. Um... As you can tell, the birds are singing. It's uh, it's a little cloudy. I mean, it ain't it ain't too much. Um, to talk about this whole GMO dish track and where where do I personally think it's all gonna lead? Um, for me, it's so hard to compare the two because uh Jay uh you know Jay's wasn't really much of a diss uh well I mean it was a diss but it was like two lines I mean it wasn't a diss track is what I mean to say it was a uh you know a couple of lines of diss to kinda you know just poke at M&E and, you know, uh, for GMO to think that, oh, okay, you know, I need to lash back with, like, a full track was, to me, it kind of over, uh, not, not overstepped, but kind of over-exaggerated the situation off the bat. Um, you know, for him to say in it, like, oh, you know, you've been kicking dirt into everybody's faces for a few months now, and it's time somebody says something, like then you know what you do is you work a little disses in like you just like for me for my own personal opinion uh like I, i've mentioned before i used to do music back in the day and actually the first track that me and the dude that i used to do music with um uh the first track we recorded was a fucking diss track and i mean full-on diss track we took on like a whole fucking record label um but to, to just kind of like, I don't know, it, it felt like it was fast forwarded a little. Like, you know, like if Jay would have come out and done, you know, like a full track fucking, you know, going each individual one by one, you know, just fucking talking shit, I could see that. Um, but, eh, and I mean, the GMO ski track was good, but at the same time, you know, I mean, it was, uh, it was mainly pretty much all gay jokes. And, and to me, that was just fucking boring as shit. Um, starting to get crazy. Once more lightning and shit. Um, but honestly, I think, I think with this whole situation that's going on, um, I think we'll see the two camps... Uh, you know, kind of back up on each other and strengthen up and everything. Uh, and that's for both sides, psychopathic and Um I don't think that it's going to lead to much besides, you know, Jay, you know, kind of lashing out at them more than them really saying much about anything. Because uh, they've made it very apparent that 
they're not even gonna bother responding to most of the shit. And, uh, you know, that's kind of GMO's forte, so they let GMO do it, you know. Um, I get, you know, that it, you know, it, it looks like, like Crazy said, it looks like there's, like, some sort of, like, civil war kind of thing brewing. Um, yeah, it's the internet for the most part, you know. I mean, if I ran into some fucking people out rocking some Magic Ninja shit, I ain't gonna say nothing to them. They ain't gonna say nothing to me. Well, I mean, you know, unless unless this uh, music is real, real life for them. Um, in that case, bad day for them, I guess. <laughs> uh, but I think I think it's a mix between you know, kind of keeping both camps. God damn, that one's gonna be loud. <laughs> uh. I think it's kind of a way to keep both camps, like, in the, uh, kind of, like, in the spotlight, so to speak. Um, and then, you know, you have g good guy tech, who's kind of straddled in the middle. Um, a lot of people are talking about how he's all on the video where he met up with, uh, Gmo and Twisted, and, uh, how... He kept saying family and blah 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 blah, and uh, I, you know, I, I, he's falling in line with a majority of Juggalos tend to, you know, where, uh, you know, uh, not saying that you know they're the majority right, but you know they're the fucking fam kids, um, but I don't think that, uh, or I think with. The only thing that kind of made me weirded out with that whole uh, little video was just kind of the smirk that Tech had. Um, that was the only thing for me that was kind of like, why, why, are, why are exactly are you doing that? Uh, you know, just this kind of like, you know, um, and. I'm sure, you know, we'll never know the full backstory on that. It could be, you know, he fucking. Um, he fucking told him some shit, you know, off the record, like, you know, fuck them, you know, whatever, but let's just try to keep cool so we don't fucking piss off all the fans that, you know, all three of our record labels obviously share. Um, but, you know, I, I, I don't see it leading up to much. We'll get, we'll get a few tracks here and there of some stuff where everybody will be like, oh shit, it's starting back up. But, uh, if Twist is not going to respond, then it's obviously not going to go anywhere. Uh, it just got dark. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't think nothing's going to happen with it. I think, you know, it, eventually at some point, like it is right now, it'll blow over. It ain't shit. Um, but that's all I got for you guys. Uh, you know, make sure you fucking drop a subscribe if you haven't, and a like, and all that fucking you know, fun, fancy social media shit. Uh, that's all I got for you guys. Mac, peace.